watching that with us is Hayley Taylor. A couple of things really stood out from the interview with those boys. I thought one was one said, when I go to the job centre, they don't really help you apply for jobs. Mm -hmm. And the other one said, well, no point going on courses because it's full of heroin addicts and crackheads. Oh, is that really me. the case? <laughs> We've got a huge problem. So, uh, you know, we, we, I asked the guests that we had in um, an hour earlier, if you had one of those young lads to a negative mindset, so rather than looking at the world through rose-tinted spectacles, it's almost sort of through dark glasses. I think they sound strange enough that perhaps they're not aware of a range of jobs that through the media perhaps they're getting an impression that if they can't get a, a high level job there's no jobs but that they need to know what actually is there and available for them. I think this Vimey. Yeah, Helly good to talk to you 8.44. Okay time to have a look at this morning's weather. Here's Carol with the forecast. Carol thanks very much. Now she began her career at the tender age of 15 at the Manchester Palace Theatre and since then Elkie Brooks has released 20 studio albums. She's appeared in the Guinness Book of Records and has a very long list of hit singles. Mm. Her autobiography reveals the highs and lows of her 50 years in the music industry. Elke, though, not <laughs> let's remind ourselves of some of your greatest hits mm. from the oh, past. Yes. What I was um, amazed by, though, listening to um, the album Powerless, which you just re-released, is yeah. actually your voice is as powerful now as it ever was.